with first ice right around the corner, you know, the excitement is, is true. We're down here at the St. Paul Ice Show, and it's unbelievable how many people walk through these doors the last three days. And the first thing that always comes into my mind is ice safety. Um, that's, uh, that's first and foremost. There's no fish uh, worth getting, getting hurt over. So think about that. Have those, have those things. Don't be too proud as an angler. You know, have your life jacket on. Have your ice picks and have a, have a rope with you just in case something bad happens. But then uh, the, Billy asked me, who, who am I going fishing with or where I'm going fishing? I said, I know exactly where I'm fishing. I'm fishing with Mr. Dave Gins. And that actually brings me to a really good point about, about you know, choosing a lake where we're going to fish without any prior knowledge and, and uh, networking. Networking is a very important part of what we do as anglers when we're traveling all around. It's very important that, that we talk with other anglers that fish. But there's tons of different opportunities for the general public to be able to find information, um, whether that's a forum, uh, whether that's a, a news feed, uh, Facebook. So go out, find those different places and ask where the fish are biting or ask for certain different things that I should be looking for as an angler. Uh, it, one thing that brings me brings to my mind is Red Lake. Red Lake uh, was extremely windy before it froze over, so it created some dirty water. Find out where that dirty water is, find out where the cleaner water is, and it's going to help you catch fish. So get online, talk to anglers that have been out fishing, and it's going to help you catch more fish.